Hi guys, it's me, Jenna. Welcome back to my channel. So today is day three of the prom looks that I've been doing this week. And today's look, I'm gonna make super bold and super colorful for all my makeup friends who like to wear colorful eyeshadow. This one is definitely for you. Um, don't forget to leave comments down below because I really want to hear suggestions about what looks you guys want to see from me. And um, like this video and subscribe to my channel to see more of me. And yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the look today and let's get to it. Alrighty guys, so first off we're going to start with brows. And as you know, I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in shade Taupe. Next step to my brows is I'm going to go in with my Ulta Beauty Brow Tint in shade Medium. Now I'm going to go in with my NARS Soft Matte Cream Concealer and conceal under my brows. Now I'm going to take an angled fluffy brush and blend that all out. Alrighty, now that my brows are done, I'm going to go in with my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Concealer and put that all over my eyelids as a base for my eyeshadow. Now that my eyeshadow base is on, I'm actually not going to set it because I want the colors I'm using to look as pigmented as possible. So I'm just going to pack it onto this wet wet um, base. The palette I'm going to be using today is my Morphe by James Charles palette. Here's what it looks like. The first shade that I'm going to go in with is called Single and I'm going to pack that into the inner corner and up into my crease and the outer corner and up into my crease. Now that I've packed that purple on and blended it up into the crease and all over my lid except for the very center because this is going to be a halo eye, I'm going to be taking my fluffy brush and dipping into the shade called Pinkity Drinkity which is a very light ballet pink shade and I'm going to go over the edges right under my brow just to blend it out a little bit better. Now to deepen up the purple color, I'm going to take the original blending brush I was using and dip into the shade called Escape, which is the darkest purple, and I'm going to do the same thing and put it in the outer corner and up into the crease and the inner corner and up into the crease. Next up, I'm going to take that same shade called Escape, which is the dark purple, and I'm going to take this shade called Spooky, which is black, mix those two, and just put it in the crease and the outer corner to deepen up those colors. Alrighty, so now to create the halo part in the center of my eyelid, I'm going to be using my NYX Glitter Primer, which looks like this. I'm going to be putting a little bit of that in the middle of my eyelid, and then I'm also going to be taking my Fatty Cosmetics Glitter, and this one has a little bit of pink and purple in it, and I'm going to put that in the center of my eye. All right, so now that the glitter is applied to the center of my eyelid, I'm gonna take a makeup wipe 
and I'm gonna wipe off the fallout that's under my eyes. All right, next, I'm gonna do a winged liner using my NYX Matte Liquid Liner. All right, so now that my wing tips are done, I'm actually gonna start on my face. So first step is we're gonna take my Makeup Forever Step 1 Primer and put that all over my skin. Next step is I'm going to take my Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation and put that all over my face as well. Alright, now that my foundation is on, I'm going to take my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and put that in all my highlight areas. Alright, next step is contour. So I'm going to take my Fenty Beauty Matchstick in shade Mocha and put that in all my contour areas. Next off is baking. So I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty Loose Setting Powder So while that powder bakes on my skin, I'm going to be taking my Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Lip Gloss and I'm going to put that all over my lips so that they're nice, big, and plump for prom. Now I'm going to take a fluffy brush and I'm going to wipe away all the powder. All right, so now I'm gonna bring that same purple shade under my eyelids on the lower lash line because I wanna make sure everything lines up perfectly. All right, now it's time to curl those eyelashes. Next step is mascara. So I'm going to take my Milk Makeup Kush Mascara and start with that one before I follow with my other mascara. Next step, I'm going to take my Buxom Mascara and also do that one. Alright, so next step is to finish off the face now that my lashes are on. So I'm going to take my Lorac Pro Contour Palette and I'm going to be using this shade and this shade to deepen up my contour areas. Next step is I'm going to take my Illuminating Bronzer by Tarte. It's called Park Ave Princess. Next step is I'm going to take my Kiko Milano Gold Waves Blush and put that on my cheekbones and highlight areas. Last step for the face is I'm going to take my Fenty Beauty Hustle Baby Highlighter and add that to my highlight areas. Okay, last step for the face is I'm going to take my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray Last step is going to be the lips. So I'm going to take my MAC Lip Liner Pencil in Cyber World. Next, I'm going to take my Sephora Collection Matte Liquid Lipstick.
Alrighty guys, so this is the finished look for today. I really hope you enjoyed the makeup. Down below to like this video or subscribe to my channel to see more of me. You can also find me on Instagram at Jenna underscore M-E-G-G. -G, and I hope to see you guys next time. Mwah!